Hey folks, my name is Promise, and welcome to more Plague Inc. Evolved Custom Scenarios. I know it's been a long time, but today we're going to take a look at a scenario that actually stood out, and I was thinking this could be absolutely hilarious, or really stupid, or maybe a bit of both. Written by Mail underscore VII, or Mail the Seventh, I'm not sure, this is Bacteria Google Translated. Basically, what happens if you take the Bacteria Plague, but then you pass it through Google Translate 150 times? I'm envisioning this is going to be a hilarious game of telephone, and nothing is going to make any sense whatsoever. Praise Provis, praise B. Alright, Bacteria type, here we go. Metabolic Jump, Darwinist, Aquasite Extreme File, and Symptostasis. I don't see any reason not to just go ahead and do this on Mega Brutal, and this is going to be Chapter 12. Welcome to this site. This is a new disease. The world must adapt to protect people from new diseases. It's yours. What's mine? All right. Select your st place of birth. Click here for more information. Change the first field to another country and confirm. All right. Saudi Arabia is the classic choice if you're going to be going for the mega brutal difficulty. Let's see what we got as far as our transmissions. So normally I would start with first stage. It's not air. It's not air transmission. It's just first stage. This helps the bacteria to get into the soil. That's not even true. Dry and wet environments increase the risk of infection. Unless something's actually changed with this from the author, and this is actually just Google Translate, this also is not totally true, but okay. What about one cup of water? Bacteria live outside the human body in warm water. This increases the risk of infection, especially when showering or bathing. I mean, kind of. You're halfway right. Not totally, though. Okay, what about going for this? <laughs> I can't shoot. What? All right, sure, why not? We'll go for this. You are sleeping now. Drinking black water can cause nausea, the coldest season in the world. This doesn't make a lick of sense, but all right, I love it already. This is amazing. Why has no one thought of this before? This is great. You could do this with so many things. What happens when you just pass it through telephone for a long, long freaking time? All right, we're going to go ahead and grab sweating, also known as you are sleeping now. And I want to get <laughs> skin lesions, but it's called painful. This is accurate. Yeah, sure. The first step is to make a good impression. The risk of disease <laughs> increases. <laughs> impression on whom exactly? This is glorious. Okay. I was kind of having high hopes for this scenario. This is already significantly better than I thought it was going to be. Uh, this one looks more or less the same as usual. Let's go ahead and pick up painful. Now, necrosis is called build a house? <laughs> Most cells bleed and die. The body is a machine. Oh my god, all right, yes, necrosis. That is normally what I would like to go for at this point. What we're doing is we're trying to get some severity up right now because I do want to get some basic symptoms that are gonna help me get enough DNA so that we can start spreading like crazy. Going for things like, I'm a student instead of coughing, what? There is bad weather everywhere, especially in the city. What about sneezing? His whole soul! Smoking at work increases the risk of infection. Absolutely brilliant. I'm really curious. So, like, what language did this have to pass through, right? Because you can't just, like, Google Translate from English to English and expect it to make a lot of mistakes. It must have been through a lot of different languages, right? What happens if you translate from English to Mandarin to, um, I don't know, uh, Swedish to Moroccan to Spanish? and so on, and just go from there. Does that work? I have no idea. I want to get nine points and start picking up that air transmission a little bit early if we can. That usually is a good idea at this point. Pick that up. Thank you. Could go for two additional bedrooms? How does that even happen? Okay, as a result, the disease remains in the environment for a long time. Both dry and wet areas have fertile soil. <laughs> Okay, yeah, sure. Some of this, do not cry, symptom mutated. Okay, what, what do we just get here? Hold on, sorry. Do not cry is nausea. Cleaning up after a fire reduces the risk of contamination. <laughs> oh, no. I don't understand how it's coming to these conclusions, but I love it. I love it so very much. Do we want to go for one cup of water? Or do you want to just hold off to get two additional bedrooms? At this point, we're close enough. I say we go ahead and grab the two additional bedrooms. It's phenomenal real estate. And actually, yeah, we can go for one cup of water as well. That leads to June 2nd. Bacteria live in cold water. This increases the risk of infection, especially when showering or bathing. Sorry, so which is it? Is it warm or cold water? Apparently, now it's both. I wasn't aware I was getting cold and uh, heat uh, uh, resistance reduction, but yeah, sure, why not? That is just, yeah, fine. Medicine in Australia is slowing everything down. We do need to be getting ourselves some level one 
Type 1 and 2 epidemics in developing countries. Yeah, I really want to get some of that uh, bacterial resistance, right? Kind of work against the antibiotics. Something just happened with the king of Saudi Arabia, and I didn't even notice it. That's my bad, but oh well. Uh, we need to get some cold transmission uh, resistance up and running, especially as we start getting into places like Russia. Greenland, of course, can still seriously mess with me, so I'm going to start building that up. I have not done a bacteria on Mega Brutal in a long time. I'm really hoping that this is actually going to work the way it's supposed to. So necrosis would be good. We're going to hold off on that a little bit. Let's pick up I am a tree. <laughs> Supposed to be pneumonia. Cold water can cause pain as more water enters into the lungs. You know, you're not wrong. That would hurt. That would hurt a lot. All right, we're gonna get uh, the uh, we need to get medical resistance level two, which we should be able to afford now. Two, as necessary. In developed countries, there are three and four types of resistance. Resistance, I should have you know, is futile. But okay, so we got all of that. Now we can go for more water transmission and stuff like that. I really do want to get June 2nd, so we have better chances of butts getting into places. Necrosis should be a thing for us very soon. A small animal instead of instead of the bio aerosol? Bacteria with attached cells live in air and water. This can cause environmental pollution, especially in dry areas. Brilliant. Absolutely brilliant con uh, conclusions they are coming to. All right, so we're getting as much transmission as I can in places. I'm sorry, Russia is called Postmark. Huh? <laughs> I didn't realize that all the names of everything we're getting. Okay, hang on, what else we got? Cold is the United States. Syria is in Canada. Mexico is just Mexican. Okay, that one actually held together. Not bad. West African, Algeria. It's not a problem is Morocco. <laughs> How? I'm sorry. What went through this that made you auto-translate to Morocco being a problem? That's just racist. In Spain. Yeah, the, the, okay. The rain in Spain falls mainly in the plain. France is just France. Nothing changed there. All right, good for them. English, colon. Denmark instead of Germany. There's Poland. They're okay. Balkan countries. Some of these are right. Australia is good. China is a restaurant. <laughs> and India is listens. Oh my gosh. This is amazing. I absolutely adore this so far. This might be one of the best scenarios I've played in a while. Let's go ahead and grab level one. Animals are susceptible to disease and climate change. And also one color for the birds. Blood loss due to pain. Yes. There is pain. Great deals of pain. All right. Please get into Greenland. Russia should at this point already be doing its thing. They're working on that cure, so we kind of need to go for things like necrosis about now. Can't afford to hold off for too much longer. Could go for enter um, the enter the game. We could go for that hypersensitivity. Enter the game. Um, yeah, that's a thing. What else can we do here? We could go for avoid heat to be prepared for every season. Sounds great, but I'm actually going to hold off for a second. Let's just kind of see. Get a little bit of time. Please get to Greenland. I saw a boat heading that direction, and I was really hoping for a moment. Norway is imagine this world. I cannot imagine a Norway. You are correct. All right, let's go ahead and grab Avoid Heat. I just need to spread a little faster. Let's get Necrosis. This is dangerous because now is the time when they're going to start closing down all the borders, but I really can't afford to wait much longer. All right, so Norway just shut down its uh, ports. Please, Russia, send a boat out. Just do it. Just yes! All right, we got in there. Hold on. That leaves the entire world is done. Perfect. All right, that means we go hard on the lethality. That means we go for see for yourself. High blood pressure can lead to a lack of oxygen, fainting, and death. Uh-huh. Crab. Difficulty breathing and cough are symptoms of pneumonia. Reading too much is harmful. <laughs> and I could go for total organ failure, also known as I don't have a car. <laughs> death is usually associated with muscle hemorrhage and premature death of multiple tissues. All right, that at least could kind of almost work, but also kind of almost not. All right, they're working on that cure very aggressively. We're probably gonna have to reset this a little bit while the necrosis starts doing its job. We're getting a lot of DNA, that's the good news. Um, all right, yeah, I think we go ahead and do a quick genetic reshuffle over there. We could go for things like the a lot and or you. I'm sorry, hold on. Pain and psychological symptoms prevent patients from seeking help and self-doubt makes it difficult to communicate with others. That's actually pretty good for paranoia. That's not bad. Then we're gonna pick up or you. This disease shortens the patient's life and causes death. That is normally what happens when you shorten a patient's life. You're right. I'm trying to work toward insanity, also known as they have scars. This causes the front leg muscles to become stiff and stiff dot two. <laughs> I don't even know what to tell you about that one, but there you go. We reset this back a little bit. I might have to go for a second genetic reshuffle. The necrosis is definitely doing its job. Chapter 2, 12 is killing very fast. Hold on. Please stop. Thank you. Go for genetic reshuffle level 2. Set that back down to 80-something percent. Most of the world is dying. We have to go for genetic shuffle re-3. 
and that gets me back down to 82%. Most of the world should be dying. This should almost be done. Okay, and it looks like we're gonna be beating this on Mega Brutal. You know, it's funny because someone was actually just recently in the Discord saying, hey, you know you never did a Mega Brutal guide for bacteria. And it's like, yeah, I know I didn't. It's because it's almost exactly the same as the virus at the end of the day. Um, let's go ahead and pick up that insanity, by the way, and just kind of delay things even further, set it back down 81%. But there we go, I still got it. Even when I have no idea what anything is supposed to mean, I still got it. <laughs> we're fine. What are you worried about? Grab paralysis, also known as your mo uh, good morning, disease lead to change in the body. What else we got here? Your sky is total brain death. Nerve damage can cause paralysis and death. You have to think about it. I mean, really, think about it. Are you sure you want to go down this route? Maybe you don't. I have no idea. Why is this even called chapter 12, by the way? Oh, because PAX 12. But it's chapter 12. Okay, whatever. The car started moving slowly. <laughs> These toxins damage blood vessels and can cause death. Medicines are complex and dangerous. Well, that's just some straight out anti-vaxxer talk right there. Virus? Sure, why not? The infection spreads quickly to other organs and tissues and becomes fatal. Very difficult. The financial situation is very difficult. We've got length. That's eh, a pretty good actual uh, definition of hypoxia over there. That's fine. I am a tree. It opens the heart and destroys bacteria in the air. Tourism and tourism. Both are both are tourism somehow. Not sure how dysentery did that, but okay, sure, why not? He said threats include rising temperatures, numerous diseases, and drought. Ease the pain. The virus attaches to lymphoid cells. An open mind is safe and free. I want to fight for you. <laughs> oh, God. This is absolutely amazing. I love this. What about gynecologist? Instead of genetic hardening. Sure, why not? Bacteria are difficult to grow in the laboratory. Useful for research. Kind of close. Yeah, why not? One move. Sure. Um, high mortality rates come with high demands. Remember, Peter Parker, with high mortality comes high demands. Now that's a movie quote if ever I heard one. After one, drugs can cause pain. Sure. 41. Permanent tattoos can cause irritation, swelling, and redness, especially in urban areas. How did rodents become tattoos oh god this is absolutely hilarious all right this scenario was everything i was hoping it was going to be and then some absolutely amazing i would have loved wait hang on i actually was gonna say i think that this is supposed to be custom but it doesn't look like it is but no it is it totally is chapter 12 has destroyed the world despite the world's best efforts the last few humans <laughs> lie dying in holes with no chance for survival. That's it. They dug their own graves and they're like, well, it was a good run. Everyone's dead. Chapter 12 has successfully eliminated all life on Earth. That is so very funny. I absolutely adore this scenario. 444 days, 78% cure progress on Mega Brutal with 48,253 as my final score. I'm shocked we were able to actually pull this off first try, especially since this is all kind of going by memory as far as the roots and kind of what I think I'm supposed to be doing, but this is great. Absolutely amazing. Bacteria Google translated. This might just be one of my new favorite scenarios just for being freaking funny. This is like the troll plague all over again. Yes, I recommend it. Why does this not have five stars? Who downvoted this? Is this totally worth the five stars? It's great. Whatever, anyway. Thank you all very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If so, I would ask you to hit that like button, leave a comment, subscribe, make sure you hit that notify bell, and I will see you guys next time.